check in, Canada. How are we doing? Are we all terrified of each other yet? After weeks like this, it can be tempting to condemn entire groups before the facts are in. And sadly, in the junior high kissing game of national hysteria, the bottle has landed on the Muslim community enough times that they know when to brace for a backlash. And even though they've denounced the lone attacker, they've been receiving harassment since the attack. But it helps to remember that the people who want us to hate and fear each other at times like this actually just feel that way all the time. They just have a platform now. You know, it's sort of like when you have nothing in common with people at a party and then someone mentions hockey, <laughs> and then you finally get to be heard because hockey is like the one and only thing in your heart, except replace hockey with racism. <laughs> so to everyone working against the paranoia and anger, like the cities who sent extra security details to prevent hate crimes this week, and the people of Cold Lake who cleaned up a mosque that had been defaced, and the passengers who kicked a man off the bus for hate speech, thank you for standing on guard for and not against each other.